Why is it 35 degrees in Texas? It's like Antarctica. Antarctica? Is it April? No, it's March. It's a polar vortex. So we're headed to Albertsons. Get groceries. With the mini me. Who almost died today because I was angry. Okay, over no squares food. and triangles. Because we have no food. Well, we had a bunch of meat. What? You're gonna die again. <laughs> you mean rectangles? Mm. So, I have planned our meals for the week. We've made our grocery list. And then, I get on the Albertsons app. And, um, well, first I get on Flip. If I need some meat or anything, um, that's usually what I'll do, is I'll get on Flip to check and see what's on sale. Oh, I, look, I look like a crazy person. You are a crazy person. Look at how I'm dressed. It's cold. I do not dress like this every day. Every day. Um, anyway, I get on Flip, which is like an app that has um, all of the ads for stores around here. So I can, if I wanted to, I could shop around and see who has the best deal on cheese this week and who has the best deal on chicken and milk and blah, blah, blah. But I love Albertsons and I think it's easy. And um, so I get on Flip, I see what's on sale at Albertsons because we don't really like to buy anything if it's not on sale. Or I don't. She would. I always buy stuff when we have money's left over from after we buy all the groceries we need. Because we always have money's left and over because I only buy things that are on sale. Um, but then I get on the Albertsons Just For You app and I get additional discounts because I'm a Just For You member, which really means I gave them my email and I let them solicit me. Um, that sounds dirty. And I choose the items that I know I need. Um, and I put them in my app cart. And then the only thing is, is when you're shopping, you need to check the your in-store basket, I think is what it's called. To make sure that they get put in there and then for all the dollars that you spend you get points and then you can use those points to get free items or get I usually use them to just get dollars off my total bill at the end of a month which really makes that last week uh, budget stretch so I say $250 we're pulling in nearly to the parking lot of Albertsons now I'm going to try to show you what, you know, our conversations in the store and how we pick items and um, a few things that we really like to buy. Hello, Governor. Hello, Governor. Let's do it. Hello, Albertsons. All right, let's get our, uh, our reusable bags. Yeah, I keep them in the trunk. Wait, trip. those ones? Yep. Oh, I thought you missed the one that we bought. Whoops. Here, let's put those bags where they go. It's not freezing cold. It's below freezing. It's below freezing. It's below freezing. There's a few that could still ripen up. There's some that are good and ripe right now. These are good. Some of the apples we just pick are good. If you're gonna buy bags, these are only five dollars. Which this is what a three-time bag. Yeah. So these are like a dollar twenty-five pounds. None of these others are that cheap. Some of the ones that are on sale over there are a dollar ninety-nine a pound. I yeah, always like this because it goes fast with the music. Because it's really hard to get. I mean, it's already kind of. We're going to use this for um, the Christmas pieces, so we'll use it before it goes back. I'm going to get and it's on sale. 
so I, I never buy these pre-sliced foods. None of this kind of pre-sliced stuff because you can usually slice up and get more out of a package and they're usually cheaper. Today they're on sale, but if you look, they're on sale because they're all brown. Ew. These are supposed to be brown. not quite right. This one's perfect, but I'm not using it today. I'm using this one in three days. On here we have veggies because we're going to have fish one night. And I just put veggies because we usually like to find whatever's on sale and whatever looks the best. But I think we've decided that we're just going to go with canned green beans for that, which are just fine. I'm not normally a huge uh, go organic, but this is two dollars. We looked everywhere and couldn't find any more basil, and we really like fresh basil on our pizza. So we're gonna go ahead and pick this up. But look at this. That looks like kidney. Ew, what is that? It's beef. Ew. It's two for four. So 0.5 is good enough. We'll just round it up. They'll charge us tax anyway. pound is $4.99. Uh, just a heads up when you're ordering from the deli counter. You gotta tell them how much you want, what you want, and how you want it sliced. We usually get it on a one sandwich slice. This turkey is puffy. The package is puffy. Don't buy puffy meat because that means it's sour. Like these, these you don't have to eat as a leak. You can squeeze those out and brown them up. If they happen to be on sale, that's what I would buy. This is that just for you that I was talking about. If you have that just for you, you either have to click that coupon or you have to have it in your thing, and that makes that a whole dollar off. That's good price. So the Rotel brand is five for five. That makes it a dollar a can, which is actually a pretty good deal because they're normally a dollar sixty cents here. Then the Red Gold, which is the next brand, are nine and nine cents a can. But the Signature Select, which is the Albertsons brand, are only sixty nine cents. So we're going to stock up today. These go on sale about every four to six weeks, so we stock up when they're on sale. These, these two aisles of canned goods tend to go on sale around the same time. So we stock up on our Rotel and our beans at the same time. Uh, because when we have Rotel, we almost always have beans with it too. Because we use these for like soups and taco bowls and things like that. Chili. Chili. Chiller. three cans of green beans, we're gonna get one more. I like to cut green beans. She likes the fancy French ones. Somehow it got dark out here. This is why I don't shop this late. Normally we shop on Tuesdays while the kids are in school because we're both off. There's not, there's a thousand million people in there and I almost throat punched the lady in front of us because she kept nearly ran it, running over Dakota with the buggy. So we're headed home, it's 6.30. I gotta cook dinner um, and we spent 76 and some change which is about half of what we planned on spending. We do still have to pick up some personal items like shaving cream and dishwasher packs, but I'm not doing that today. Um, I just needed to get some groceries so that we could eat for the week so we could stay on budget and stay on track with our diets. <laughs> 